Hey everyone, my name is Kavion or Kevin, whichever you're comfortable with. And in today's video, I'm going to talk about my experience living here in downtown Surrey uh, in Metro Vancouver, Canada for around four months. After living for around three months with my sister in her one bedroom uh, condo in downtown Vancouver, which was after moving here to Canada after living for around 25 years in Iran and my experience has been really positive so far I know like before moving here so many people told me like don't go to Surrey it's not safe and so on but I just had to do it because uh, my university campus is in downtown Surrey in Civic Plaza Hotel um, which is Conklin Polytechnic University's business campus. So it's a sunny day and I'm sweating a lot um, but it's a good thing because like I don't I used to like cold better but now I'm more into sunny days after moving here. Um, I'm, I'm not sure how much warmer it will get in the future but uh, right now it's been pretty good so far i'm close to the house so let's get inside so this is my little shoe rack and then i close the door and lock it and use this little knob as a key holder so as you enter the house you kind of enter the kitchen and you can see that it has most of the things that you need uh, and except for the dishwasher but I'm okay with that and right on the refrigerator we have some magnetic souvenirs that my ex-partner bought me and I have them here to kind of remember and, and are good memories and inside the fridge right now I don't have much things um, mostly the things that I bought in the last video um, I haven't been cooking for the most part recently so these are some vegetables that frozen vegetables that my mom brought from Iran and some barberries that we use for cooking um, I bought this Black & Decker uh, food processor from Amazon for I'm not sure I'm like less than $30 I guess I'm not sure uh, I'm gonna put the price tag on the video and this is my Xiaomi Mi Band 7 that I bought from Iran and I bought that buy sell or be sell uh, I'm not sure how it's pronounced vacuum cleaner from Canadian Tire uh, it was on a deal and I bought it for only $30 there's also this uh, rice cooker that I bought from Walmart for $35. Most of these kitchen utensils were from were already here when I came to this unit. Uh, the stove was here, the refrigerator was here, obviously something pretty common in Canada. And there were also these uh, pots and also this cutting board. They all came with the units and here is where I uh, put my trash can and some cleaning stuff and in these inside these cabinets I uh, keep some of my cooking things like um, seasonings and so on so walking inside the house uh, we have the kitchen on this side and also the living room slash bedroom over here as we walk in I have my 3d printer and uh, my desk over here uh, this 3D printer is from Anchor Make. I bought it for around $400 from Amazon. And also we have my fake plant, which I bought from Amazon for around $50. Over here near the bed. And the bed came with the uh, units. So I didn't have to pay extra for the bed or mattress. And also it had a different type of um, bedding, but, but I changed it from white to gray because looks nicer and also um, when it was white it showed hair and dust so easily so I always had to like clean it up and 
things like that i i will still clean it up but um, i don't have to just do it every day and we have my rgb light here uh, which i bought from amazon for around 27 dollars which was a pretty good deal and i can um, adjust it to whatever color i want and some other type of dynamic colors i can control it from the app and with alexa also google but i don't use it because i as i use siri so it doesn't work with that this closet i bought it from walmart i put my clothes inside here here's another look at the window and the bed and the closet over there and the fake plant and my 3d printer and desk and over here we have my tv which came with the unit as well this is a smart tv and has um, most of the apps that i need such as youtube and netflix and um, i'm pretty happy with it the 55 inch tv and right below the tv we have some of my 3d printed things and uh, i put some fake plants on top of them as well to look make them look nicer uh, but no one has purchased them yet if you live in surrey or vancouver let me know if you want these 3d printed pots um these are my own designs but these three are not my designs now they're here we have my 3d print filaments which i'm going to add more to the collection in the future but that's it for right now and here is a little closet and um, a little extra space behind it which i used to store some of the things that i don't need like shoe rack with that came with the unit but i changed it with this one and i hold some of my belongings inside this closet and this door is closed from both sides so um, this is just um, for decor purposes it doesn't open up to anything moving from here we have the bathroom which is a quite nice looking bathroom and this unit doesn't have a washer and dryer but I have a dryer over here and it works pretty fine I bought it from Amazon for $72 and um, it's a really great addition like um, when you come out come from outside and like your clothes are sweaty like you can dry them up over here or I, I, I also use these um, these foldable uh, small washing machines for some small objects and I can dry them up inside this as well And that's it. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. And uh, have a creative time.